Hey, what's going on, Dead Drawers? This is Danny, back again today with another Pat Crack episode. Uh, today's gonna be a little different, it's gonna be a little special, uh, something we haven't tried before. We're actually gonna do a box war uh, against another YouTube channel. I'm sure, if you, I'm sure you've heard of them before. Uh, they are the Pokemon Evolutionaries. If you haven't checked them out, the link is in the description before, below. You're gonna have to look at it no matter what, uh, so you can judge this competition, which I have already guaranteed we were gonna win. Uh, but the Pokemon Evolutionaries, Professor K and N, are both some outstanding individuals. They are probably the hardest working YouTubers I've ever met before. Uh, they're wonderful, they're charismatic, they're both extremely handsome. Uh, they're just overall nice people. So if you haven't had time to check out their channel yet, definitely go check out their channel. Make sure to give them a sub. I'm sure you already are because they're just amazing individuals. But we're going to be opening up a brand new box of Roaring Skies. Uh, so the new redistribution or reprinting or whatever you want to call it uh, has happened. We're lucky enough to get our hands on one of them. It is a sealed box. Uh, the Pokemon Evolutionaries is also going to post their box. And we're going to just kind of go back and forth and see who can be the victor. I have guaranteed victory for DeadDrawGaming.com. I know, I know the lighting's not great in here in my makeshift uh, YouTube studio that I have in my uh, basement. Uh, so it's not the nicest, but I have guaranteed victory. I told Professor K that he doesn't even need to bother doing this because we're definitely going to win. Um, so hopefully I can live up to my arrogance and my cockiness and my confidence. Uh, but we're going to let you guys be the judge of that. If you like what you see, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and make sure to comment. This is the most important part. Comment on our video, comment on the Pokemon Evolutionaries video. Their video is going to be in the link uh, just, just down there. If you look below, click on that link, watch their video, and let them know that Dead Draw Gaming blew them out of the water. Uh, so if our box is better than theirs, make sure to vote for us because that's what we're going for here. It's all going to be based off of what you guys say. Uh, so we're not going value, we're just going to go with demand. And that is viewer demand. So hopefully, like I said, we will come out victorious because I'm confident. I really am. So with that, let's get this started. Okay, so here it is. A factory sealed box of Roaring Skies. Probably one of the most popular, one of the most hyped uh, sets that Pokemon has ever had before. I'm going to open this up hopefully without ruining anything and we are going to be looking for some obvious cards. So Roaring Skies is the expansion or the set that I probably opened up the most booster boxes of in the most cases of. So I won't hopefully pronounce too many names wrong. I won't pronounce much wrong hopefully but 36 sealed packs. There they are. So pretty. So exciting. It's like a kid on Christmas all over again. We're going to start out with this nice Latios pack here. Mega Latios and just see what we get. We're going to be looking for those lovely shamans and that secret reverse seeker, VF seeker. And we're going to be looking for oh, a whole slew of things. Uh, so we'll see how it goes. Like I said, make sure to let us know in the comments below what you think. We're going to go through these pretty fast. Uh, we're going to start off with a Bagon, Ninkata, Pidov, Dunsparce, Voltorb, Togetic, Healing Scarf, Dragonair, the reverse is a Fletchling, and our rare is an Articuno. So, not too much in the first pack. I did mispronounce uh, names right away. Like I said, I wouldn't. Move over to this Rayquaza artwork here. Uh, Rayquaza was probably one of the most hyped cards in this set, if not the most hyped card in this set uh, when it first came out. We've got a Bagon, Electrike, Talo, Execute, Halucha, Dustox, Fero, Unpheasant. Our reverse is a Dragonair, and our rare is a Unpheasant. Slightly underwhelming there, uh, pretty much. Batten zero, 0 for 2. Moving on to the lovely Deoxys artwork here. Hopefully, Professor K and N and the Pokemon Evolutionaries didn't pull too much from their box. Because we're not starting out too hot yet, but we're not too far into it. So, Togepi, Execute, Natu, Fletchling, 
Wormpole, Dragonair, Steven, Silcoon, our reverse is another Bagon, and our rare is a Dust Dock. So no hollow rares, just three regular art rares. We're going to move on to this lovely Gallade pack here. Ooh, I see a Swablu. That's always a good sign. Anytime you see a Swablu, it's, it's a guaranteed good thing. Not necessarily, but I'm just making something up to try and change the mojo. Swablu, Bagon, Execute, Fletchling, Pikachu, Executor with Shake It Off Taylor Swift style, Winona, Unpheasant. Our reverse is Meowth and our rare is a Talonflame. I do remember being slightly over underwhelmed um, when I opened up a bunch of these booster boxes originally when the Boring Stacks first came out, and then as we went on, the packs definitely got better. So no need to worry yet. There's still lots of hope. We'll see how these go. <gasps> Togepi, Execute, Fletchling, Talo, Electrike, Firo, Pelipper. Revive, Reverse Tropius, and a Rare Binet. So, let's see what, uh, we'll go with Latios this time. Let's see how it goes. Just a bunch of rares so far. Nothing special. Still very early on in the game. Alright. Dratini, Halucha, Natu, Wingle, Fletchling, Pelipper, Togetic, Latios, Spirit Link, Wide Lens Reverse, and our first Ultra Rare is a Hydreigon EX, regular art, nothing overly special, but it gets us out of the gate. We'll put it back there for now. Forgot to bring sleeves down here, like the amateur that I am apparently, so... We'll sleeve it up after this video is over, but we have an EX. We have officially broken the non-EX curse in Roaring Skies. So, moving on with a Gallade bot, uh, pack, and we'll see what this brings us. Come on, Shaman, Dratini, Cascoon, Halucha, Wingle, Inke, Winona, Rayquaza, Spirit Link, Electrode, our reverse is a binnacle, binnacle, however you want to say it. And our second EX, two EXs in a row. It's a Dragon Regular Art Rayquaza EX. So not too shabby. Now we are turning the corner. We are coming back, slowly but surely. Definitely not the two most expensive cards in the set by any means. But hey, who is going to complain? <laughs> not me. It has been a long drought of me opening up the X's, so I'll take it. Not too shabby. All right, let's see what Deoxys brings us. Ninkata, Dunsparce, Wingle, Dratini, Electrike, Togetic, Healing Scarf, Dragonair. Our reverse is a Natu. And our rare is an exact two. So, um, pretty cool. The basic and its evolution form, one after the other. Latios artwork was good to us last time, so we're gonna hope for the same this time. All right. We start off with a Haulucha Dratini. Inke, not two, not two, hey, two not two, one pack, not bad. Wide Lens, oops, Shellgun, Mega Turbo, not a bad card at all. Talo, and our rare is a Talonflame. So our first Mega Turbo comes after we've already opened up two EXs, uh, but Mega Turbo is definitely one of the better staple cards in the set. So we'll take that. Not a bad pack at all, by any means. We are opening up a Rayquaza uh, artwork pack. Hopefully it brings us a Mega Rayquaza. All right. Binacle. Pikachu. Inke. Meowth. Cascoon. Ninjask. 
Shelgon, a Revive, our Reverse is a Dustox, and our Rare is an Articuno. So, still somewhat underwhelming, we're in a little bit of a funk. This lovely Deoxys here will definitely bring us out. I'm feeling it in this pack. I don't know if you guys are feeling it. I am, though. This is all going to turn around right here. All right. So. Gligar. Meowth. Spiro. Natu. Shuppet. Pelipper. I've actually sh seen Shuppet uh, used in a very competitive form uh, in Jason Klasinski's winning regional deck uh, with the Blat attack. Wally, Dustox. Our reverse is a Ninjask, and our rare is a Togekiss, which is exactly what we had hoped for. Eat your heart out, Professor K. We just got a Togekiss. Togekiss. Game over. Just like we planned it. All right, so moving on to a Gallade artwork. Hopefully we can pull a full art soon instead of these just regular art EXs. Meowth, Binacle, Gligar, Shuppet, Togepi, Fero, Pelipper, Revive, Reverse Revive. Hey, to Revive one pack, nice. And a Victini Rare. All right, moving on to the Latios pack because it helped us once, and that's next in line, I suppose. All right, guys, let's get something good here. All right, confidence is key. Voltorb, Togepi, Shuppet, Spiro, Wingle, Wide Lens, Fletchlander, Ultra Ball, there's a staple card. Not a very expensive one, but definitely one in every pack. Our reverse is an Inkata and a full art Hydreigon. So, two Hydreigon EXs, one regular art, one full art. Once again, not really breaking the bank, but an EX is an EX. We are up to three ultra rares. We are about halfway through. It's about the normal pull ratios from this set. Let's just hope the money-making cards are at the end. Or if you're voting and really love Hydreigon, hey, are we pleasing you or what? I mean, let's face it, who does not love Hydreigon? I am not, I'm not, I'm indifferent about Hydreigon, to be honest with you. Voltorb, Gligar, Shuppet, Meowth, Cascoon, Ultra Ball, Hey, finally our first trainer's mail. This is a very good staple. It's a few dollars a piece. We will take that any day of the week. Fletchlander, Fletchlander, Double Dragon Energy Reverse Hollow, not bad. And a Dragonite Hollow Rare. So that is a very good pack. Uh, better than any other pack that we've had so far. And that's saying something because we have pulled three EXs. So just that Trainer's Mail and Reverse Hollow Double Dragonite and that Hollow Dragonite is about $7 worth of cards right there. So not too shabby. We're not going off of values like I said. We're going off of pure viewer's choice. So hopefully everybody loves Hydreigon because we got two. Voltorb, Pikachu, Wurmple, Bagon, Binacle, Wide Lens, Manectric, which is one of my favorite Pokemon. Fun fact for you. Trainer's Mail. Nice. A reverse Pidove. And our rare is an Exactu. So another Trainer's Mail. Very nice. Moving over to a Deoxys pack here. Let's go for a Shaman. Or a Secret Rare VS Seeker. Or a Mega Rayquaza. I wouldn't be too upset about that. Natu, Spiro, Boltorb, Inke, Cascoon, Widelands, Shelgon, Mega Turbo, not bad at all. Tranquil, Reverse Hollow, and a Full Art. Well, I guess if you want to call these Full Arts. Uh, it's a Togekiss. It's not good by any means, but it's cute. It's a cute little 
Delta Hollow, not not too shabby. We like those. Mega Latios, moving on. Give us something good here. All right. If I can get this pack open. My goodness, this is my first pack I've ever opened or what? Always a good sign when you struggle to open up a pack. All right, let's check it out. Wormple, Ninkata, Binacle, Spiro, Dunsparce, Dustox, a double Dragon Energy, we'll take that, Latio Spirit Link, a Reverse Hollow Pelipper, and oh, it's an EX, and it's the best EX, Thunderous EX. Wow. All right, so EX number four, our fourth Ultra Rare of the bunch is definitely an Ultra Rare for some reason. Thunderous EX, not the best card, but it is an EX. Not a playable card, but it is an EX somehow. We'll take it. Beggars can't be choosers. If there's one thing I've learned, an EX is an EX, no matter how you slice it or dice it. All right, Electrike, Bagon, Pidove, Ninkata, Swablu, Silcoon, Steven, Gallade Spirit Link, our reverse hollow is an Execute, and another EX. Oh! There she is, folks, the Shaman EX, regular art, the beauty, that is all beauty, because of, I don't even know where to put it, definitely not in a sleeve, because I didn't bring any down, like an amateur, but there she is, she's out there, oh my goodness, saving grace, as you can see, a Shaman EX, right there, next to a bunch of not as nice EXs, Woo! All right, we can relax. We can relax. Hopefully, the Pokemon Evolutionaries cannot catch us. Wow, we needed that. So, a lot of people have asked me what I think the reprint or redistribution of this set will do to the value of the cards. And the answer is pretty obvious. They're going to drop, okay? They're going to drop for a specific period of time. I don't think they're going to drop very long. But I do think they're going to drop. Electric, Talo, Execute, Halucha, Pikachu, Ultra Ball, Staple, Trainer's Mail, Staple, Fletchender, and a rare Togekiss. Oh, two rares, one pack. Articuno Delta Species, not too bad. It's a little weird. Reverse Hollow Togekiss rare and Articuno rare. Not too bad. Doesn't happen very often, but we'll take that. Yeah. Anyways, so for a while, Roaring Skies was up to about $250 to $300 for a sealed box, even though it's still in format right now. Uh, so people were buying these boxes and kind of hoarding them because of the Shaman value. Shaman did top out at about $100 and has since gone down a little bit. I do expect it to continue to fall. Um... I don't think it will go as low as $20 or even $30, but it probably should bottom out at about $35 for a regular art, $45 for a full art, and then it'll go up again in price. So if you're freaking out, um, definitely look into getting some Roaring Skies boxes if you haven't already. In a couple years, these things will be worth their weight in gold. Expanded is still a big thing, uh, so don't worry too much about it. If you're trying to profit, this is still the set to profit on. Electrike, Bagon, Ninkata. Pidov, Dunsparce, Unpheasant, Fletchender, Altaria, and Reverse Hollow Dragonite, and a Hollow Rare Deoxys. Such a cool card, Deoxys. Let me know in the comments below also. Aside from saying that Deadraw Gaming won this, this box war, tell me if Deoxys is your favorite because I want to talk to you. Deoxys is an awesome card, not my favorite. My favorite will always be Arcanine. However, the Oxys definitely gave it a run for its money when it came out. It's just so cool. I mean, it's like from outer space. It's, oh, it's just, it's like it's from out of this world. All right, let's keep the karma going. Let's get something else here. Seal the deal. Electrike. Talo. Oh, no, Shaman, come back. 
Oh, that was scary. Talo, Bagon, Pidove, Swablu, Gallade Spirit Link, Skyfield, our first Skyfield. Nice. Ninjask, Gligar Reverse, and a rare Klefki. I think that's our first Klefki as well. All right, so we've got maybe 10 packs left. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 14, 15. Okay, so I don't know how to count. We've got 15 packs left, and we have five ultra rares so far, so this is a pretty awesome box. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Hopefully something good here. We've got an Execute. We've got a Natu, a Fletchling, Wormple, Talo, Tranquil, Altaria, Rayquaza Spirit Link, a Reverse Fearow, and a Rare Skarmory. Alright, Gallade, give us something good. Give us something to be happy about. Let's keep the pressure on. I have not talked to Professor K or N to see how their box went. They have, may not have even opened it yet. So, we gotta keep this going. Keep up the hype here. Not to... Togepi, Fletchling, Execute, Talo, Firo, Mega Turbo, nice, Winona, Reverse Rayquaza Spirit Link, and our rare is a Swellow. So we've hit a little bit of a lull since the Shaman, not that big of a deal. We're moving on to Deoxys, which is definitely our friend. I really don't remember what the art was that we pulled the Shaman out of. I mean, artwork doesn't matter too much. It's just kind of a superstition that I follow. So, let's see. One, two, three, one, two. Let's hope for the best on this one. We've got a Cascoon, Natu, Wingle, Fletchling, Bagon, Dustox, Double Dragon Energy, Latio Spirit Link, Reverse Howalucha, and a Rare Banet. Uh, each Pokemon card tool in play has no effect. Didn't see a whole lot of competitive play. Still hasn't seen a whole lot of competitive play. But in, I guess, the idea of it is kind of cool. Alright, moving on to Mega Latios. I know we've pulled, I know we've pulled an EX from you before, Latios. Let's keep, let's keep the mojo going. Hope for something good here. We start out with a Shuppet. Fletchling, Togepi, Execute, Dratini, Tropius, Tranquil, Revive, Reverse Voltorb, and a Unpheasant Rare. So, no staples, nothing fantastic. We have about, oh, Shaman, you fell again. We're just going to mix this up a little bit and just leave you sitting right there instead. Uh, we have about 11 packs left. So almost, a, we're a little over a third of the way done through this box. Hopefully we can get a couple more EXs for you yet. And really seal up this box break war. Cascoon, Haulucha, Wingle, Inke, Togepi, Tropius, Switch. This is our first Switch out of, what, 25 packs so far? Gliscor, Reverse Steven. And a rare Zapdos. Very nice. Alright, moving on to a Gallade pack. Let's get at least a staple. We gotta get the momentum back here. We're running a little bit cold. Time to turn things around. And this is going to be the pack to do it. I can feel it. Wingle. Binacle. Pikachu. Inke. Meowth. Gallade Spirit Link. Air Skyfield! Nice! Finally a staple. Ninjask, Reverse, Wally, and an Upside Down Trainer. Oh boy! It's a full art. Why Nona? In the house. Why Nona? She was upside down. That's how excited she was to see us. She was so excited she had to go upside down. A little weird how they got somewhat sloppy here, but that's. Where's the quality control? I got nothing to say on that. Alright, so we are up to six Ultra Rares, which is about average for any box. So there's anything we get now is kind of just a bonus. Alright, haven't pulled any Secret Rares yet. Maybe this will be the pack. Cascoon, 
Halucha, Dratini, Inke, Natu, Switch, Ninjask, Skyfield, nice, Reverse Hollow Gallade, and oh boy, it is a full art break, Quaza EX. Wow, seven ultra rares, guys. This is, we are putting on a show. We have seven ultra rares so far. We have eight packs left. We could get eight ultra rares in this box. This is absolutely insane. Oh, confidence is paying off so far. Arrogance, hopefully I wasn't being arrogant. I really didn't know what was gonna happen, obviously, so. Hopefully not all these redistribution packs have eight or nine ultra rares in them. Not to Pikachu, Bagon, Wingle, Swablu, Healing Scarf, Gliscor, Switch, Revert. Hey, two Switch, one pack. Nice. And a rare Articuno, which has seen a lot of play in competitive world. So we'll put that in the competitive pile right there. Not too bad, not too shabby. We are moving on with a Latios pack. Latios has been good to us. We have not pulled a Latios yet. I'm okay with that because it's not the best, highest value card in the set, that's for sure. Still looking for that VS Seeker and that Full Art Shaman. We're running pretty low on packs and running very high on Ultra Rare, so I don't know if we're going to get it. Meowth, Spiro, Natu, Shuppet, Dratini, Electrode, Manectric, Mega Turbo, nice. Reverse Holo Togepi and a rare Dragonite. Haven't had a lot of holographic rares, but when you pull seven EXs, you can't complain. Or sorry, seven ultra rares. Two full arts. Maybe we're due another, well, three full arts if you include the trainer. Maybe we're, we're due for one more full art and maybe it'll be a shaman. And then one more secret rare and it's a VS Seeker. I'm not saying it needs to happen, I'm just saying it would be nice. Okay, Dunsparce, Voltorb, Gligar, Shuppet, Meowth. Hey, shake it off, Executor, Taylor Swift style, Healing Scarf, Shellgun, Reverse Hollow Natu, and a Rayquaza EX regular art. That, my friends, is Ultra Rare number eight. We have five packs left. I have never, ever pulled nine ultra rares in a box before, ever. We could be witnessing history if we get one more. I have pulled eight, not many times, I think maybe once, but I have never pulled nine. This, wow, this is fantastic. Don't know if we're going to be able to get one more out of these last five packs, but it's not going to be for lack of trying. Swablu, Voltorb, Togepi, Shuppet, Spiro, Tropius, Tranquil, Revive, Wingle Reverse, and an Altaria. Hey, nice. Our first Altaria. Not a bad card. Has seen some play in uh, Mega Rayquaza because of its ability, which each of your colorless Pokemon has no weakness. So it helped out a lot with uh, Mega Rayquaza for Lightning Pokemon. Jolteon, Zeepstrika, Raichu. Uh, those were cards that really kind of ruined Rayquaza. Inke, Binacle, Haolucha, Cascoon, Meowth, Dragonair, Steven, Silcoon, Nice, a reverse holo trainer's mail and a Skarmory. Who cares about you? We've got a reverse holo trainer's mail. That's like a $6 card. Woo! Three packs left. Coming down to the end of it. Can we get a ninth ultra rare? Please tell me we can. That would make my day so much. I would be over the moon completely. I might, I, I don't know, I might stay up all night then just out of pure excitement. Okay, Pikachu, Wormpole, Bagon, Binacle, Gligar, Shake It Off, Taylor Swift, you executor, Winona, Unpheasant, Reverse, Hollow, Carbink, that is a rare, and our holographic rare, Beautifly, 
Not too bad. That is a hollow, so I guess we'll put it over there, even though it's not competitive. All right. I can hear you guys. You're telling me to open the Gallade first, so we'll save the Deoxys for last. I understand. I understand where you guys are coming from here. We're feeling it for the Deoxys, not so much for the Gallade. But let's face it, one of these is going to have a Fuller Chamin, one of these is going to have a Secret Rare Seeker. And we're just going to throw the camera down and walk away. Talo, Electrike, Bagon, Pydove, Ninkata, Healing Scarf, Gliscor, Switch, Reverse Hollow, Unpheasant, and our rare is a Shed Ninja which was actually somewhat of a competitive card when you combined it with Mew, you could hit for quite a bit. Deoxys, folks, this is our last pack. Look at it, stare at it, pray for something great, pray for number nine, hope for the best. Let's see what we get. We're going to give away one more code here. It's our last pack. That is called Karma. Pay it back. Let's hope for the best here. Like I said, it's tough to get nine. I don't know if I've ever seen a box have nine before. So if you have gotten that many, please let me know, because that's insane. Swablu, Wormpole, Ninkata, Binacle, Spiro, Ultra Ball, Tropius, Steven, Reverse is a Bagon, and our last card is just a rare Dragonite. So we didn't get the Full Art Shaman. We did not get the secret rare vs seeker we're throwing cards down because we've got too many of them sitting in piles next to us uh, but just a quick recap here here are a bunch of our just staple cards we got one reverse hollow trainers mail we got a bunch of skyfield some mega turbos we've got some other trainers mails ultra balls double dragon energies as far as hollow rares go we got one two uh, well, that's a reverse. Three, that's a reverse. Four. So only four hollow rare cards, but the best cards that we got were probably these three here. We got a Shaman EX regular art, a Full Art Rayquaza EX, and a Full Art Winona. And then our other ultra rares were a regular art Rayquaza EX a Full Art Hy Hydreigon EX, Regular Art Dragon Rayquaza EX, Regular Art Hydreigon EX, and a Regular Art Thunderous EX. So yes, that is eight. Count them, eight Ultra Rares in one box. Not too shabby. If you liked what you saw, make sure to go down, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Uh, make sure to watch our videos. Check us out in the description below. We are all over the place. If you haven't heard of DeadDrawGaming.com before, check us out. Pay attention. We are focused on taking the Pokemon TCG world by storm. You will hear us down the world, down the road, hopefully. Um, and also, make sure to go over. Check out the link below for check out the description below for the link to the Pokemon Evolutionaries, the most amazing guys you will see on YouTube. Way better than me. Way better than all of us. They are fantastic. Watch their box opening. Vote in the comments below for which box was better. I'm very excited to see what Professor K and N pull. I hope we have enough. I don't know if they can beat eight ultra rares, but you guys are the deciding factor. So if you liked what you saw here, comment down below. Go over to their, their page. Comment on their video. Tell them Dead Draw Gaming means business. And with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys have a wonder, wonderful night. Uh, thanks for all of your support. You guys are amazing. And make sure to vote. Thanks.